What is up, guys? Dark Nine Gaming. Sorry, this is loading a bit slow today. Here it comes. See? It, everything's okay. Anyways, today I will be playing PVZ2 today. And I will, well, come up here. I decided to make a video of whatever I was doing today. Go to play. I'm just gonna play the Vinata party. See how it's done. Let's okay, so what I got. I got the Hurricane, not helpful. The potato winds are kind of helpful. Okay, so one here, one here. This music. Right. Anyways, I forgot, I forgot to do the intro, but anyways, this this is me, Dark Nine Gaming in the house. This is Dark Nine Gaming, and today I'll just be doing stuff. And please like this video and subscribe. It really help my channel grow. I'm not careful about it, really well.
I mean, this is gonna be a while, guys. I mean, this is the pinata party. It's still taking a while. That's kind of surprising in my book, don't you? Don't you guys kind of think that? Okay, I'm just gonna wait on them. I'm not gonna watch it again. It was pretty easy pinata party, but I'm not sure I want to do it again. I'm not sure I will. I don't want to waste uh, my video time with you guys. Anyways, what we got? You know what? Today I will um do this defeat ancient Egypt zombies. Sure, why not? I got a perfect strategy for that. Just gonna blow them up. Blow them up. Best way to destroy ancient Egypt zombies. It's kind, of, it's kind of well. Blow them up first off. You need the cherry bomb. Get to him. You need the cabbage bowl and turn some fire would also be handy. And don't forget the gold bloom to start you off. If you, if you have the gold bloom with you, you'll never have. To. Oh yeah, shaman call power. That's also another good combo. And some walnuts to start you off. The primal one, that's what well, you want to go with. The throw. Red, set, plant. You want to start off with the gold room. And get on that side of yours. I want to place down one of these guys, of course. And then when they come, you start placing down cabbage. Well, I, I I really was kind of bored lately, so I just just decided to make a video and maybe do some quests for you guys. So yeah, I'm just doing it now. You know what I'm saying? I'm on day nine, but that's what it picked for me. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna be playing Fortnite on this channel as well. I mean, who wouldn't play Fortnite? I'm pretty I'm gonna play Fortnite on this channel. I am. I forgot about that guy. I gotta ice him. I'm gonna kill him now. Or should I blow him up? There's one second I don't have so I'm gonna blow him up. Sorry guys, I'm gonna go blow him up. I'm gonna him. Or maybe I'm just gonna flick him. Okay, that'll do everything. Okay, how many 
zombies that I kill. Okay, 28 zombies remaining. That means, that means I got down 12 zombies. Pretty impressive. Okay, 100 coins. Three boomerangs. Ooh, now I can all of them. That's pretty good. Anything else? Four for the three. Oh, nice! Level 33, Peter. Here I come. Awesome. So, guys, anyways, I got a few more zombies left, and anyways, I would go over with those ain't me, these plants. There's the blue ring. The 50. Level them up. Now it is 4.5 recharge. Damage is now 25 for each hit. That means 50. Toughness, 350, and plant food power duration. Continue. So the feeder will upgrade the damage only and duration skills. Repeater. I mean, the, re the repeater. Now, his stun cost got lowered down to 175. His toughness is now 400. And now he does 30 damage per P. So now he does 60 damage at all. My P shooter is level 2. I just need 3 more for him to get him a to get him that level to get him the same level as the three peter it's pretty much the same thing as the repeater except the repeater is like two peas in one but yeah that's the third same damage for p and everything except for the only difference between the peter repeater and pea shooter is well the damage differences I gotta pause this video quick. I'll be right back, guys. I'm back. I just had to take that jacket off. I right, now I am ready to go. Let's roll. Enchantment. I guess it. Yeah. Okay. Anyways. What I should do now? I mean, um, the red stinger needs leveling up. Okay. Now his toughness is still elevated. But now it is 40 damage per those red stinger thingies. And the red stinger is a appeasement as well. I wonder if I could check the torch with. It says peas. But it doesn't say which one. I wish it would say which peas. Like, does it work with the red stinger? I mean, I, I, I'm gonna go try that out real quick. I know this ain't the Torchwood episode, but I think I should try that out. I think I should. Let's try the Red Stinger. Go to Ancient Egypt level 51, I guess. I just need a level to try it out in, so I'm just gonna pick one. Okay, so let's do it, Torchwood, Red Stinger, which she'll be, he or she will be down here. Stinger will be my first row, second row defense, pretty much. I'm gonna put the also the gold bloom. I'm gonna need him. Enchantment, coal power, and more. I'm gonna drop.
this guy down, and we're gonna try this out on his cone head. So he doesn't work for the also doesn't not work for the red finger for some reason. Think that I can do it? I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I sure can. Well, let's go somewhere where the zombies are at. Let's go to level. Let's go to level 12. That's one of my main levels I like to do. This time, I'm just gonna go to the twin sunflower, the walnut. I mean, the potato mine. So we're gonna go with well, just a basic strategy. This cabbage pole. You can blow some stuff up. Cherry bomb. I'm a walnut. Also, so I'm gonna help out the cabbage. I'm gonna bring in the gold balloon, of course. So we're gonna bring it, help out with the cabbage. I'm gonna bring some apple mortar. That plant. Ever since I've showcased all these plants, you see my latest videos, I've been using them a lot. So yeah, so you might be seeing me use a lot of plants I've already showcased, but I'm never gonna, I'm, I would never use a plant, premium plant that I'm planning on showcasing, and I use it. But if I'm not planning on showcasing it, I'm gonna use it whenever I want. But if I'm never, if I'm gonna showcase it, I'm never gonna use it until I showcase it. If there are any, if there's any other plants you want me to buy or get with gems, tell me and I'll get them. I'll tell them. I'll get them for you. And just leave them in the comments below. Okay. I'm just gonna win this. I want an apple mode on my.
yes, got it. That means I get two pinatas. Okay, what do I get? Coins. Four for the potato mine. Just need a little bit more for the walnut. Four for the further theater. And that should be it for that one. I'm also gonna get some for the um for that quest I just did. For the quest I just did, I'm gonna also get some. Kill 50 zombies. Yeah. Anyways, gonna get it now. Gonna open it up. Okay, bloomerang. The ten for the bloomerang. Okay, bloomerang's already on level three. I mean, he was, he wasn't, but now he's gonna be able to level him up. Nice. Ten for the bloomerang. Nice. That's pretty good. Any more events? Nope, just you. Okay. Bye, Doctor Zombies. By Dr. Zomba, some Lux Stellia, some Magnet Shroom, and Trapping and Go for free. I'm not fine. I'm just gonna upgrade the room real quick. Okay, now, now it costs 150. That's nice. It has 400. And now it does 30 damage. And also, its toughness is now 400. So it's better than a repeater. Totally. Uh, I think I'll probably use this, the boomerang. Probably. But this is pretty much the same thing. Except for this, except for, you know. The only thing different, there's, that boomerang costs less. So I think I'd go with the boomerang, guys. Well, <clears throat> well see you peeps later. This has been Dark Nine Gaming. Bye.